What's up guys, Random Razor here with another product review video for you guys today and today we're going to check out the Mastercraft 10 gallon workshop air compressor. So of course without further ado, let's slice this open, check it out, test it out and give you guys my quick in depth review. So for those of you who are looking for a versatile tool to add to your garage, tool collection or workshop, then an air compressor may be a good choice to add. The versatile and useful for many applications, it's definitely something you want to consider. The air compressor comes in your traditional Mastercraft cardboard packaging here, nothing too spectacular about that. And after removing that, the first and pretty much the only thing that we get is an instruction manual and of course the air compressor itself covered in clear plastic. Since the air compressor didn't come with anything, I did pick up a couple other accessories. Uh, first off here we have the Mastercraft Air Tool Accessory Kit, which is a pretty good kit to pretty much get you started. As well as a 50 foot hose, this is from a company called Maximum, the hybrid rubber PVC air hose, which I also picked up at Canadian Tire. And later in this video, I will demonstrate how this compressor works with a couple accessories. So taking a quick overview of the air compressor here and what it has to offer. As I mentioned, this is the 10 gallon model, but it is also available in higher capacities as well as smaller ones. The main construction of the tank, of course, is a high grade steel along with a steel kickstand and an adjustable steel handle with a rubber grip. All this painted in your traditional Mastercraft bright blue. The front kickstand also features two rubberized grips to cushion the impact when you lay it on the kickstand. And there's also a horizontal kickstand on the back here with the same built-in rubber feet. I've also found that the rear kickstand also acts as a good spot to tie up your power cord or even an air hose. Because the 10 gallon model is a larger model, built-in wheels are a standard feature. And last but not least is the motor. Because this is an electric model, it features an oil-free pump and motor for low maintenance operation. The motor itself has 1.8 horsepower, and with it, this model can deliver 5.0 CFM at 40 PSI and 4.0 CFM at 90 PSI. Overall, the maximum output PSI pressure of this unit is 130 PSI. So what do these numbers mean? Well, basically, you can do everything from painting to using tools such as impact wrenches, nail guns, to something simple as pumping up a tire. Continuing on, we also have the safety valve on the left side, two gauges, one for your tank as well as one for your tool, a built-in regulator, and lastly, not one but two outlet ports. And I also forgot to mention the power button on the back. So let's fire this up and see what it sounds like. So the first thing you probably notice is that this air compressor is very loud and that's because of its 1.8 horsepower motor. That being said, with a bigger motor like this, it means the tank can be filled up more quickly and therefore you don't have to have it running all the time. But anyways, here's a few things you can do with an air compressor and for those of you who pick one up, you'll find that air compressors do come in handy for a variety of uses. So the first obvious thing I can do with an air compressor is obviously blow air. A little tool like this that came with that kit I showed you guys earlier is something great for example if you're cleaning a laundry duct. Another example that we can test out is that air compressors are very useful for nail guns. And one final example is something as easy as pumping a car tire. And it looks like we're good. Overall, as you guys saw through those examples, it's an air compressor that works. I have been using this for the past three weeks now just to test out some of the features and things that I could use an air compressor for, and so far I'm fairly impressed. Everything from pumping up car tires to bicycle tires and adding trim to places I've never thought of doing with a hammer and nail shows that air compressors do come in handy. Tasks such as cleaning little crevices with dust that you normally couldn't reach with a Swiffer duster to even cleaning ducts is something that an air compressor makes an easy job doing. In terms of this particular model here, I do like the 10 gallon size. It's a little bit bigger than your carry-on size. But Mastercraft did include a kickstand and wheels to make it easy to roll around. That being said, if you're looking for something to not just to use in your shop but also take around with you to your work site, then a 10 gallon model is probably the biggest one I would recommend because it's the largest model that I could barely lift with so anything bigger than this it's probably going to be a pain to lift into a truck bed and something that would require two people with if you're planning on carrying an air compressor to other places other than your garage or work site. 
The 1.8 horsepower motor is more than enough to fill this tank up very quickly. And in terms of the size of the 10 gallon model here, I would say it's more than enough for the average homeowner or for someone who needs an air compressor in a shop. In terms of pricing, Canadian Tire does retail this for $400 around there, but I have seen it on sale, and actually at the time this video was made, half price for $199. So for the price and the quality that you get out of this machine, I'd say it's a pretty good deal, especially if you can get it on sale. In terms of any cons or things I don't like about the air compressor, the one thing I would say is that because it's a 10 gallon model, it's getting a little bit on the heavier end in terms of carrying this around. But the biggest thing for me is that the motor is very, very loud, which is no surprise since it is an air compressor. So for those of you who like to work late at night and you need to use your air compressor, it may not be the most ideal thing to run late in the night, especially if you have your wife sleeping or neighbors right next door to you. In conclusion guys, if you're looking for an affordable, high capacity air compressor for your needs, you definitely can't go wrong with the Mastercraft Workshop 10 gallon air compressor. Anyways, thanks for watching guys, hope you all enjoyed the video, and if you have any questions or comments about this air compressor, let me know in the comment section there down below. Hit that like button as always helps me out, and I'll see you all in the next video.